All right, I'm gonna holler at y'all. I'm serving. I'm gonna just start getting ready. I'm gonna do a more full beat for you guys. For you guys, this is not a tutorial. It's 9 14 p.m. So I'm gonna just start getting ready. <laughs> Real bad man. My water, because y'all know I need to survive out here in these streets. Okay, these Queen streets with the gang in them, 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 crap, crap, boom, with the gang in them. All right, I'm gonna holler at y'all. I'm serving. Oh my god, he's so nice though. It's 6 a.m. Um, cap 7.01 a.m. And I'm eating the rest of my wings stop and I'm home. I'm very happy to be home. I'm very happy to be eating wings stop for breakfast. And I'm going to sleep after this. A lot. I was going through my little junk drawer that I have and I realized that I have another memory card for my camera so I found it, thank you God. I found my memory card and now I can like record without it shutting off every two seconds because that's just what my camera has been doing because my memory card is literally full right now. I'm in the process of like catching you guys back up on all my old videos and content so I can't like delete stuff off my memory card like I usually do because it has not yet been edited and uploaded and all of that right now it's 12 45 i just took a shower through this on because i don't want to get ready in a robe right now so i am finally getting ready to take myself to arthur and sons and like italian american style restaurant and this is what i'm talking about with my background but i'm just gonna be open, be open and honest on this channel, guys. This is this is my living situation right now, okay? It's a hot mess. <laughs> but um finally taking myself to this restaurant that I've been dying to go to. I did message Yanni, she didn't get back to me, so I'ma just go alone, which I was actually in the mood for, so I don't mind. I am bringing you guys, of course. So we're going on a little date today to the city. I'm gonna do something natural 
for my makeup and I picked out like a pretty cute outfit. Hopefully it looks good on, I have it laid out. I feel like once I even redo my room, I will get better at showing you guys my outfits because I don't have any like cute place to really set up the camera and show y'all my fits. So um, yeah, and when I went out the other night with my friends on Saturday, one guy complimented my outfit and I'm like, oh! Like, I love that. Like, he was like, I like your fit. I said, ah! I didn't say that, but I was in my head. I was just like, oh, thank you. But, <laughs> because y'all know I be trying to like, step up my outfit game. I've been trying for years. And I feel like I'm finally getting into like, a space where I know what it is that I like. And I'm starting to put things together. What I'm still slacking on though is accessories. So I, like right now my outfit is cute and I barely have any accessories to go with it. I need to get better on that, but I just love like putting thought into what I wear, feeling cute, wearing stuff that makes me feel good and all of that. Like I told y'all, I like to be comfy, cute, and confident. That's how I like my outfits to be. And I'm also realizing like I kind of like the modest look a little bit. Like I'm leaning more. I think I've always kind of been a little bit modest with my outfits, but it's definitely increasing now as I'm getting older. I just think it just looks better, honestly. It's not even on some like, you know, must not show my body, but it's like, it just looks better on me and just to me, in my opinion. So I'm not putting no like pressure on myself. I'm just like getting ready slowly chill not rushing nothing like that like this is just a day for me to just enjoy and i posted my video yesterday so i'm happy about that and just to like be open and honest with you guys like last night today is june 1st so last night i was just praying and just having some conversation with god and i thought to myself like I should really pick out some goals for myself for July so I picked out like two finance goals and then I picked out two goals relating to YouTube and I just really for July want to get more consistent again because I definitely as you guys know I'm trying to like recover from taking like a month or two months off in total so regain my consistent momentum and I'm also trying to work with at least two brands in the month of July um when I had like taken my time off you guys know like when I filmed hauls and stuff like that I was working with brands a lot more frequently um and I haven't really since I kind of like fell off from making videos consistently and because of the fall off my views have gone down a lot so it's like I haven't really been working out with working with brands but during like my few months off or like my little break I was contacted by like a couple brands so I reached back out just letting them know like hey like I'm back creating and you know just keep me or I would love to work with you in the future I'm sorry I missed out on the past collaborations whatever whatever and I already was contacted back by one of the brands for an upcoming collab so it's like ah! like things things are working out um like it might be gifted but that's okay baby steps baby steps okay gifted is better than nothing so um yeah and i'm just very appreciative that i can even say i'm in contact with any sort of brands like that's just crazy to me pray about your goals for anything because i feel like because i prayed about it like it just worked out like quicker you know um yeah so that's all i have to say about that i am going to finish getting ready i don't know why i woke up and my voice sounds like this Oh, I feel like when I go out and I be like singing and I be turning up or whatever, 
and I be straining my voice, it takes like a minute for my voice to realize what happened. Cause yesterday I was fine. And today all of a sudden now my voice wanna be sounding like um, um donkey of the day. Okay. I'm about to leave. I'm just doing the finishing touches on my outfit. And I tried on the new bag that I got from Coach and it looks really good with the outfit. So I think I'm gonna break it in today. And I'm gonna use it. What better time to use it than a solo day. You know what I mean? I am wearing this because it's a little bit more chilly today and I kind of like this vibe anyways. <laughs> My goal is to stop in some place and get some pictures. So I finally made it. I'm a little bit far though, so I have a little bit of a walk to go. Got the Google Maps and I'm ready to walk and I'm here really early. It's like 3.28 and my reservation isn't until 4.30, but it's only gonna be for one. So I, I'm pretty sure they could just take me anyways. I kind of found the perfect area to like vlog in. So I took off my headphones and we're walking with purpose because I feel like I know where I'm going. But why is given like Google Maps really don't, they don't know what they talking about sometimes. It's a little bit of a walk. So <laughs> we're trekking babes. I did not expect for it to be such of a walk, but it's a walk indeed. Ooh, this is cute. Casamigos. Casamigos? No thanks. Hmm. Something else that has been on my mind is that, okay, she's single and whatnot, and I know you're supposed to like go out more alone to help yourself like get approached easier because it's easier to, you know, go up to somebody when you're alone instead of like in a group. Cool. Good, how are you? Thank you. Jesus, help me, Jesus. Jesus, Mr. Help me, Jesus. This is 
be seen. I need like a little vlog camera. The angles is just bigger and we'd be able to see like the food and me. <laughs> With this camera, child, it's one or the other. We just saw the Caesar salad. I'm about to try that. I was really looking forward to this. I love a Caesar salad and it looks so good. I thought it was going to be much bigger, but this is actually perfect for me. I wish I had some chicken. <laughs> but even without the chicken, very, very good. Yes, it's perfect. Can I do the mozzarella sticks? Also? Thank you. So good in a little full, so <laughs> and I was thinking that I was gonna have space for like a pasta as well. Child. I don't know about that. But. Just a week ago, crew at my house, and we party every weekend. So on the radio, that's my favorite song. Make me bounce around like I don't know, like I won't be here long. Now the thrill is gone. Got no patience, cause I'm not a doctor. But why is you lying? Girl, why you move faster? Yeah, me casa su casa. Got it stripping like Gaza. Got so high on volcanoes. Now the flow is so. City, this restaurant actually was Google Maps literally said 34 minutes walking I'm like never will it be 34 minutes walking it's giving 40 minutes babe and it was a lot like windier and breezier earlier so I'm here thinking you know okay she's a little covered she's a little modest but the weather the weather goes with it it's blazing it's hot I'm walking way down by mozzarella sticks but we move so I'm literally on like 23rd Street. I'm gonna walk over to like 34th. 
where they have like all the shops and stuff like that. And child, I'm gonna see whatever happens after that. <laughs> I was not expecting this journey, but I'm walking anyways. Okay guys, I made it to the bus stop. If only you knew how far I just had to walk to get here. Never again will I make a reservation or come here by um by choice at this hour. Too many people coming out of work, um, crowding up the street and no, sorry. And I, I personally feel like if I'm trying to walk and I'm accidentally touching you, we're too close and there's too many of us. That's what I think. So this time of day, this time of day is a no for me. Um, I'm sweating, so I did stop at a Zara. But even the Zara was packed. I stopped at a Zara and even the Zara was packed and I was already sweating and just feeling like a hot mess. So I wasn't able to stop and get no pictures in the outfit, which is fine because, you know, I'm one to reuse, reduce, recycle. And I kind of, I'm craving a culotta, so I'll probably, oh, catch my bus. Hold on, bye. Okay guys, I made it on the bus. I even lifted up my bra strap because I said no. I have to walk with passion, with force. So I made it to my bus and like as soon as I got here, it basically came as y'all just saw. So I'm here now. There's AC, it's booming. I'm about to put on my headphones, chill, relax, and enjoy. I'm hot. I wish I was not this hot. I wish I was not sweating this bad, but child. I literally just walked like 40 minutes, so. Hey guys, made it back home and got myself a culada from Dunkin'. I really wanted something cold, being that I was just so hot and like something sweet, like a little dessert. Mm. So I got cool out of now that I'm back home and cleansed and nice and just in my right state of mind child that heat was something else it almost took me out it almost took me out it almost took me out child I will not even lie to you by the time I got back on the bus I was dying of sweat so the walk to the place I was still sweating but I didn't think like it wasn't too bad the walk from, I assume because like it was rush hour, the amount of people that was outside, congestion, heat, ew, um, and it just was too much. So let's do a thorough review of Arthur and Sons. Location. I went to the one in West Village, which I assume is close to Greenwich Village. That's not my side of town, boo. That's not my side of town. I didn't really like the area. It wasn't really that urban. It was very like, okay, we're creeping into where white people move when they move to New York area. You know what I mean? It was not, um, it was not West Side vibes. It was getting to the East. There was that aspect of it. So it was pretty far from me, I won't lie. Kind of close to the Chelsea area as well. So location wise, very deep. I feel like if they had one more in the middle of Manhattan, like closer to Central Park area, they would get a lot of, a lot more like customers and it would be a lot hyper because the aesthetics in there was really nice. The restaurant itself was really cute. Um, and I liked that the basement bathroom area had like that graffiti going on. It just brought like a whole different vibe to the um, spot. So I liked that. The food. Girl, out of 10, I would rate it a six. The Caesar salad would be amazing with chicken. I don't know if they had that um, 
option to add chicken i really wasn't looking but um i was but i don't think they had that option they probably did because why wouldn't you that salad was good and it was a little different because it had hints of garlic which is not typical for caesar salads that i've had like maybe like the slightest hint but it had a strong kick of garlic to it so that made the caesar salad pop i really liked it and the mozzarella sticks had a really good cheese pull but i'm not a big fan of the breading the breading on the mozzarella sticks was not my favorite but the mozzarella and the pull of the cheese was great so out of everything i would rate it about a six would i go back like I tried the two appetizers that I wanted to. I was gonna try a pasta, but being that I was getting full, the serving sizes were shareable. Which I knew going that it's a family style restaurant, but I just still wanted to try it out. Not really interested in their pasta. Sorry. And the, the bill was like, I don't know if people mentioned the bill, but it was a little, not really that pricey. It was like 50 something for just the mozzarella sticks and the salad. And I literally drank water. So if I got a drink, that would probably be like $70 or something. I really don't know. But it was all right. It wasn't bad. I had fun on my little solo date. Child, I wanted to talk louder in the restaurant. But there was a couple that was like right there. And it was just me and the couple in the restaurant. And it was quiet. So they could hear what I'm saying. And they kept looking at me. So I just... You know, I kept it cute. I kept it mute because that would have been awkward. So I wasn't able to talk as much as I wanted to, but it's okay. It's 7 18 p.m. I'm home with the fam. Gonna have the rest of my Duncan. Probably watch TikToks, turn on my AC even higher, and just vibe out for the night. I'm coming from I look crazy. I know my ABC. I'm with my sister, my mother. We are going someplace very special. I look exhausted, I look crazy, but that's not what we're here to talk about. I am going to do something very crazy. We are going, you will see. Making a very exciting purchase if they have it. I'm waiting, guys. I have to go home. Oh, my life is just like I've never looked so busted. I have to take out my braids. I'm getting my hair redone on Tuesday. I'm having a brain meltdown because I'm exhausted. I'm tired, but we just came from breakfast and it was very good. I'm waiting for the camera, but for some odd reason. They're having a hard time finding it. So fingers crossed that they find it. Fingers crossed that I look better than this tomorrow. Yeah, child. So we waiting. Waiting. Wait. Waiting. Everybody's playing the waiting game. Alright. Sony ZV1F, right? Yeah. Thank you. We have an open box one if you want. Much cheaper. But the box has been opened. What is this? Oh, this is yours. Yes. Oh, I uh, uh, we should have it. Here. There's one item left. It says here. I know where it is. Yeah. Thank Four you. Seven. What's your phone number? Right. You can get the biggest in 
an airbag in the store that you blown it. I gave them the drill, they set it up, I got them on it. I bought a new paddock, I had the white, so what you throwing them? Taking these drawers, I'm gonna be up until the morning. If it ain't your car, you just a lease, so you don't own it. If I'm in the club, I got that fine one up the farm. And the back end just came in and all crunch. Spouse the Lord, cute shit, they all on us. I'm from Atlanta where young niggas crunch. I know they hating on me, but I don't read comments. Whenever I tell her to come, she run. Whenever it's smoke, we ain't burning. Juke too hard, don't stand too close, you gon' fuck around the ground. Out this way, doing all these shows. I'm a dancing in the dial and this shit is a parade I don't want your train, I'm going one and not a slave I had that drawn down too many, but she gets saved I love the butter seed, but I'm a one Korean vitamin C serum, y'all It's more vitamin C than alone Just got to my hair appointment and I'm looking crazy under here but let's start to my appointment <laughs> Guys, we're having a little sister day. It's actually National Auntie's Day today. But besides that, that's besides the point. We're about to just run a few errands. I need to go to Target and Ulta because I need new skincare products like bad, y'all know. I've been talking about my skin for dumb long and it's like starting to get really bad. And I might even go to like Five Guys. You know something about what food gotta be in here. Sorry. You'd be able to see like the whole. Yes, no, maybe so. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Do they fit? I don't even know my size anymore. Okay, guys. So we made it to Tall Shy. So the other day when I was in here, I seen they had this like whole supermarket section. So that's where I'm going because they had some shrimp that was like $8. And I said, that's like a deal, is it not? So yeah. No, just, just walk, no, I was, huh? You need nothing. Skincare is at Ulta. The shrimp is here, the shrimp, the shrimp. Yes, man, I need the shrimp. For some reason, I don't know. You know, I don't know what I'm gonna make with it, but I just feel as though it's necessary. way off what <laughs> you'll see when you watch it back oh you wanna i wanna see but i highly doubt it if they would have those dumplings you remember when those oh. dumplings was going viral yeah but that was pretty much a joke it was sure was sometimes i feel in the mood for a chip or two but chips these days are what seven dollars a pop but not at target where they're five i'll take one for now no, um, guys, and I have my other camera, but guess what, boo? I have not figured out the settings, so here we are until I do. What's that? Why not? headed to Ulta, the place that I actually need to be. I tried to stop by the other day, but they was talking about some, they're doing inventory. So, wasn't able to get what I need. This facial cleanser that I used to use all the time from Origins, is Origins not here anymore? Sorry, do you guys still sell Origins skincare? No. Origins, yes, it would be so. Guys, I'm upset. 
it was this one exfoliating body scrub so they only have one more of the the, the um, face wash that I like and it kind of already used fake and they definitely raised up the price I'm gonna revisit I'm gonna look for some other options and then see if I have to get that I will I should just get a whole good molecules everything. I've tried good good molecules, but I've never tried the cleanser. Acne? That seemed too intense for me. I need a wash off. No. So I'm gonna just try this. Why not? I think. Next. We're gonna go someplace very, very for the first time in my life, I'm trying five guys. We're gonna do a whole sit down something when we get home, but I'll see you then. Because I had messaged my friend, had messaged me, Anjanu, you guys know Anjanu, I think, um, about a game night at her house. The girl gonna message me today. That is today. So, I'm kind of like trying to figure out what I'm doing for the rest of the night. This is just a grilled cheese burger with bacon, mayonnaise, ketchup. Good. I just missing something though. Now, I think I'm used to like going out to eat. I'm used to going out to eat by myself, but I'm really not used to recording like with my phone. So we're gonna have to make that work today. Let me see how this looks. Okay guys, so I'm going to lunch by myself, but I'm taking you guys because, you know, social anxiety a little bit. You could be doing me, recording yourself, thinking nobody's watching you. Just a slight turn of the head, look with the eye, and I see somebody staring me down. It's really like, yes! <laughs> usually scream I can't right now so that is it for today's video I hope you guys enjoy I hope you guys enjoyed this weekly vlog you guys know this is the catching up series so I do not have a proper outro but look to my <laughs> guys the room renovation vlogs are coming give me like two more uploads and then we'll start getting into what's I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thanks so much for watching. I don't want to touch on it too much because I think I'm like gonna, if I do celebrate, I'm gonna put it in a vlog. But this is actually my 200th video. I'm so proud of myself right now. Like YouTube does not 
notify you about that. I don't think they do at least. But 200 videos? Nah, we're gonna get into that in a vlog coming up but yes as for this one thank you guys so so much for watching i love you guys from the bottom of my heart i hope you enjoyed make sure you leave a comment down below like and subscribe and i will see you all in the next video bye